let's go for the main event of the evening. We've got Sanjeet Kudwar taking on Atabek of Kyrgyzstan once again for the featherweight title. What, what's going on inside the cage here, guys? Well, that's some celebration. No, no, that's that's Azizbek. That's Azizbek and talking to Alumi. All right, so now we are moving on to the last fight of the evening, the main event, which is a featherweight title event, yeah. MFN's first featherweight title event. On one hand, we have Sanjeet Budwar representing India, and on the other, we have Atabek representing Kyrgyzstan. And we've already seen how lethal the Kyrgyzstani fighters are. So this is going to be one hell of a main event. Well, besides being lethal, Manan, they've been a little bit notorious here. Aziz Bek came in and he's been shown his way out. Yeah, he was certainly shown his way out by Coach Daniel. Well, I'm so excited. You know, it's been a fantastic night of fights. And we've got the main event, the final, the first inaugural featherweight title fight is up for grabs. Sorry, I am title. so excited. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like you to give a round of applause to the silent killer, Sanjit Budwar. My name is Sanjit Budwar. I am a professional fighter. I am a professional fighter. I am a MFN 10. I am a Kyrgyzstan fighter. I am a sports fighter. Sanjeet Budwar, the silent killer. This man packs a punch, he's got dynamite hands. He explodes with just a punch, making his way to the cage as the first in the inaugural MFN featherweight title is up for grabs. John, what do you have to say? We saw him fighting last night. Guys, he is, like you said, crazy explosive. And his right hand carries dynamite. Let's, Let's look at his keys to victory. He is very active with his lead hand. He nullifies takedowns and he's a cardio machine. He can go all the way till the end of this five round match. Well, for sure, he's pretty active with the lead hand and that's what generates the knockout power. You know, something else that's amazing about him is that he somehow continuously wins all these fights with his hands by his waist. It's just mind-boggling to me as a coach. He wins fights with his hands by his waist. Well, I think let's not just say hands, let's just say explosive hands. Over <laughs> to Jared as we welcome Atabek. And his opponent, Atabak Abdimetalapov! Hi guys, my name is Atabek. I'm from Kyrgyzstan. Uh, I'm 26 years old, but I, I based in Dubai. I train here. I'm focusing on Friday's fight for now. His fights and his... I think it's okay. It's okay, so... Friday, you're gonna see Friday. Come on, make your way, then I will see you in the cage. Kyrgyzstan ke Atabek bad rahe hain cage ki taraf apna chhanda liye apne saath. Bahut hi vispotak fighter hai ye. Kyrgyzstan ke ek aur fighter ko hum pehle dekh chuke hain, to hume pata hai hume cage mein kya dekhne ko milega. Hume dekhne ko milega. Skill, strength, grit, resilience. We're going to see the true heart of a warrior. This fight is going to be five rounds and the winner will become the featherweight champion. So both these fighters have to give it their best. Let's look at what Atabek will want to do in the cage. He will want to wrestle and land early takedowns. He will want to counter strike and save his chin. Because Sanjeev Budwar, jo hai, when it comes to throwing knockout shots. Well, yes, Atabek, be, be saving thy chin because we know the kind of power that Sanjeev generates with his hands, especially with the lead hand. And I'm sure he's going to 
he's, he's, he's hungry for the title and he's going to generate some magic tonight. Guys, if Adebek is anything like Azizbek, we are in for a show right now. Bilkul, let's look at the tail of the tape. Sanjeev is 27, Adebek 26. Atabek has a height advantage of 9 inches and both of them have weighed in at almost the same weight. And now we go to Jared for the official introductions. Ladies and gentlemen, this time has come for the main event of the evening. Five five-minute rounds in the featherweight division. The three judges scoring this contest ringside are Vishwesh Desai, Manas Demiri, and Mohit Chawla. And as the action begins, the referee for the fight, Daniel Isaac. Ladies and gentlemen, for all in attendance and fight fans across the globe, we introduce you to the main event of the evening. Dubai, are you ready? This is the moment all you fans have been waiting for. First, we introduce the blue corner, presenting a boxer. He stands at 171 centimeters, weighing in at 65.8 kilograms, representing India. Make some noise for the silent killer, Sanjit Bodhwar. And now, introducing the red corner, a mixed martial artist. He stands 180 centimeters tall, weighed in at 65.7 kilograms. Representing Kyrgyzstan, make some noise for Atabek Abdelmadalipov! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, as the action begins, the referee for the fight, Daniel Isaac. Gentlemen, you both are aware of the GAMAF rules. Let's have a good, clean fight. When I ask you to break or stop, please stop. If you want to touch gloves, do it now or step back. Are you featherweight title fight बहुत ही धमाकेदार होने वाली है हद से ज़्यादा मज़ा आने वाला इस फाइट को देखने में क्योंकि ये दोनों ही फाइटर बहुत एक्सप्लोसिव हैं जॉन बोथ दिस गाइस आर एनिमल्स दे आर आई एम सो एक्साइटेड राइट नाउ ऑन पिन्स एंड नीडल्स यू कैन से वेल द इंटरियर कंट्रीज ऑन द फीट वंस अगेन एस सजीत बुधवार Strawweight title. He takes on Atabek, representing Kyrgyzstan in the red corner. और मैं आपको एक बात बता दूँ संजीत जो हैं वो एक पक्के जानवर हैं बहुत खूंखार तरीके से फाइट करते हैं कई बार हमने उनको लोगों को नॉकआउट करते हुए देखा है एक ही पंच में. Both guys feeling each other out right now. Kind of a waiting game. Well, in this fight, Atabek has a little bit of reach advantage. बढ़िया किक लगाई संजीत ने. However, Sanjeet. however, the TKO rate or the finish rate of Sanjeet is 75%. He's got six TKOs out of eight wins in MMA career. Oh, San Sanjeet. Sanjeet is an animal, guys. He is. He doesn't talk much. He Sanjeet doesn't give long speeches. First. Well, he's an epitome of being an MMA athlete. He's an epitome of fitness. He's an epitome of being a beast, I should say. And in general, he's an extremely nice guy. Well, he doesn't talk at, talk at <laughs> all. But, but you saw the press conference. It was, it was a bit funny. <laughs> he is funny. It was hilarious. Both these guys were trying to exchange words. Sanjeet is bringing a little bit of pressure with his leg, with his footwork here. But his hands are down. His hands are. He better keep his, his hands are always up. down. Well, that's his fighting style, ladies and gentlemen. We've got Sanjeet Budwar, the silent killer in the blue corner, taking on Atabek for the inaugural I feel like Adebek is just title. being patient right here. Neither guys are in a rush. They all have five rounds. 
Yeah, they don't want to take any chances. They certainly don't want to uh, make a mistake here by rushing in too early. Ooh. Oof, hard shots there by Atabek. Atabek goes charging in with 1-2, one, 1-2. Two, one, two. Back into his stance. Sanjeet moving forward. I like how Sanjeet is moving his head a little bit more than the last time I saw him. He has a little bit more body movement, a little bit more head movement. You see him keep looking down as if he's going to shoot or strike for the legs. Yeah, he looks very alert and ready. He's very alert and ready. And Atabek knows it. He charges in, throws it one-two once again. But retreats. none of those shots landed. Oh, that's Sanjeet Budwar. Sanjeet those, targeting the liver again. Those uppercuts, vicious. You know, if Sanjeet here needs to continually attack Atabek's leg when he's in that wide stance. If he adapts that wide stance, Sanjeet needs to be kicking that calf muscle. Yeah, and his kicks are landing, so he can keep They are landing. That. He's finding success. He needs to continue when he finds success. Both of these fighters need to establish a jab. A jab is your range. No, nice check left hook here, guys. John seems he's listening to you. Now, since you said <laughs> legs, I checked out both the legs, and I think Atabek has weak legs compared to Sanjeet here. Yes, beautiful takedown defense right there from Sanjeet. Agreed, man, and beautiful takedown defense. If he can continually stuff the Kyrgyzstani's takedowns. Of the four wins that Atabek has in his career, two have come via decision. So I'm sure he's not going to, you know, I'm sure he's not the one who can probably go ahead and, and go for a knockdown or maybe a submission. He's somebody durable who, who takes it easy and goes for the full three or five rounds. Something that's really standing out to me as a coach here is that Atabek is with his chin up. His chin is not down, his chin is up, he's standing tall. He needs to really watch out for Sanjeet's overhand right hand. And I think Sanjeet is watching it and he's ready with an upper hand, upper, upper hook, sorry. Another Here we go with some left jabbing. Hand. Sanjeet goes to the body. I really like when fighters attack that body. Sanjeet needs to re-establish his jab and go back to kicking the legs, guys. We've got a lot of Kyrgyzstan fans in attendance. They're shouting for Atabek. They're hooting for Atabek. The Atabek atmosphere here in Dubai is absolutely crazy. Everybody's loving the show. Adebek landed a clean hook too there. What a game changer it would be if Sanjeet just lifted his hands and covered his head. I know you really want him to do that, don't you, I really John? do, guys. I'm a coach and this drives me nuts. You're just not able to understand why he has his hands down. I don't get it. Should well, we send you to his corner, John? Maybe next camp, guys. <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk to Coach Allen. <clears throat> that was a great first round. Both the fighters looking very sharp. That's Atabek charging in. Sanjeet does a good job of moving back. And then he fires some shots of his own. Beautiful left hook there. I certainly would not want to be a judge for this fight right now. Very close round. Well, yes, John, I agree with you. You know, being a judge is a difficult, difficult thing, and I think it's easy being a commentator than being a judge. <laughs> <laughs> There's no kidding about that. John, what would you tell Sanjeet right now, apart from putting his hands up? I would say establish your jab and continue with the calf kicks. Chop him down like a tree. He's tall, his chin's up, open up some shots, and catch him with that nice overhand check left hook. Well, John, the thing is that Atabek has a reach advantage and he's not letting Sanjeet come in. He's ready with his, you know, one, two. The moment Sanjeet comes in, he's going to throw his one, two. But Sanjeet's kicks are landing. That's why We've those kicks, kicks land. That's the importance of that calf kick. He has landed it at least three times in the first round. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. MFN 10, the main event. Nice show of sportsmanship. Title fight. Well, yes, featherweight title is up for grabs between these two warriors. This is round number two of five rounds. Nice jab to the body Wait, there. 
Whichever fighter decides to continuously use the jab will win this fight. Oh, I I'll like your note prediction, that down, John. John. Note it. The moment you said that, Sanjit threw two jabs. I need to be in Sanjit's corner. I think you have some telepathic connection with him going on. He's listening <laughs> to you, John. Nice leg kick by Atabek. Ooh, nice Double jab into a straight right. Wow, immediately Sanjeet fires back. He says Hindi me kate eat ka java pathar se. I think Sanjeet is looking for a hole. He's going to throw a big, big uppercut there. That's what he specializes in. Push kick by Sanjeet. You know, the sweatier they get, the more dangerous those push kicks are because you absorb all the sweat from the chest and or head of your opponent and you go back down and you have a higher tendency of slipping. I would be very cautious here. Nice body shot by Sanjeet. Bahut acha kaam kar rahe hain Sanjeet Atabek ki body ko attack karne ka. Kick ke saath punch ki combo. Beautiful. You know the thing with having your hands down by your waist is that it telegraphs all of your punches. Sanjeet loading up that right hand, looking for one big shot here. He almost nice, threw that. Nice jabs by Atabek. Matt, look at the sweat. These guys are sweating profusely, <laughs> as you say, John. Sweating like pigs. Sanjeet goes in charging. His guns are loaded. He's shooting at Atabek. What a fight, man. What a fight. The main event couldn't have been better than this. Continuously attacking that body, Sanjeet. That's nice. Nice work. We're literally sitting on the edges of our chairs because we know at Whoa. any moment, Ooh. at any moment, one of these fighters could land a finishing blow. The crowd is going wild out here in Dubai. Oh, oh a nice catch. Him down. Catches the leg. leg. Badia takedown. And Sanjeet's like, let's get back up. <laughs> well, usually what we get to see in MMA is let's wrestle, bro. Get it? These guys don't, don't want to wrestle. They want I'm, to be, I'm appreciating it. They want to be on their feet, trade shots, sling some heavy leather at each other. Guys. Nice every, left hand. Every time out of back plants that lead leg, Sanjeet needs to be kicking his calf. Lots of slipping going on. Are you guys seeing that as well? Yes. Nice. There it was. Keep kicking that leg, Sanjeet. Adebek needs to continue using that jab. We're seeing some good head movement from Sanjeet. Sanjeet really seems like he's loading up for that one shot. Adebek seems a little bit like one Ooh. step ahead. Nice punches nice. there by Sanjeet. As we said, Sanjeet's got hands of dynamite. Whoa, and he's swinging for the fences. Both guys working extremely hard. The inside of the cage, the canvas is covered in sweat. Less than a minute to go in this round. Sanjeet's reaction time is very good. He reacts to Atabek's movements very quickly. Atabek slips. Sanjeet says, get up. Let's box once again. <laughs> I really want to see Sanjeet utilize a jab. I want to see him utilize his uppercut. I want to see him just knock the lights out of somebody. We know he can. Well, he's... Oh, nice there it jab. Was. That was a stiff jab right on the chin. Guys, look how Sanjeet just moves back when Atabek attacks. It's almost as if we can see Atabek coming. Guys, we have a fight on our hands here. Oh, we sure do. MFN 10's main card is living up to its hype. <laughs> Round two comes to an end. Again, I would hate to be a judge in this position right here. Would hate it. Let's look at the replay. Well, 
The floor looks a little bit sweaty here. Adabek throws in a couple of jabs. Sanjit moves back, comes back, charging. Sanjit is an excellent counter puncher. Well, yes, that, that's what we can see at display here. Look at the way he's counter striking Adabek. Another one. Sanjit is an absolute wild man. Ek dum khumkhar janwar hai Sanjit. Tisra round shuru hone ja raha hai. Ho sakta hai this will be the first fight that actually goes to the championship rounds. That would be awesome, man. Well, of course, you know the previous three title fights did not go to round five. And I hope this one goes too. Really? You hope that? I want to see somebody get knocked out, Rahul. I tell you, I would love it because the more time I get to spend with you guys, the better. Well, I just don't want Matrix Fight Night 10 to come to an end. And therefore, I want to see five rounds. Both but fighters coming out with a little bit more urgency this round, guys. Well, a lot of people shouting Atabe. <laughs> Or probably MFN. Yeah, it sounded like MFN to me. That's what I thought I heard as well. Sanjit going for a little push kick, not sure. I think Sanjit is trying to find a sweet spot wherein he can land some good punches. And so far he's not been able to get that spot. Adebek is doing a great job controlling the distance with that lead hand. You see he's got it out, he's kind of pawing. Sanjit gets close, he uses it, he jabs. I think what Sanjit needs to do is angle out and fire in. What do you have to say, John, about this? I, I cannot disagree. I, I agree completely. Besides, keep his hands up, utilize his jab. If he cut a few angles, he would be able to set up a couple moments to use that big, powerful right hand. I like how he's switching stances, moving his head. Creating opportunities to strike. And he's trying to tease Atabek with that kick. Defended that kick. Oh! That was a beautiful slip and counter. Both guys really picking up the pace right now. Wow! Wow, look at that striking from Sanjeet. He's moving his head, he's throwing kicks and punches. Yes. Solid combinations. That makes me very happy. Atabek fires a nice left hook. Sanjeet says, no, no, it didn't do anything. Again, notice how Adebek continually uses that jab. Nice lead hand by Sanjeet there. Going to the body again. He fakes the body and comes high with that nice overhand over left. I'm really liking the movement from Sanjeet in this round, John. Me too. He seems to really be moving his head a lot more. He's saying, I'm going to utilize my boxing movements. I'm going to try to get in a little bit closer. And I'm going to hit you. Yeah, yeah. Just look at the way he slowly moves in like a lion ready to pounce. Well, John, we have seen Sanjeet's gas tank. However, the reality is that Atavik has never fought five rounds. And yeah, Atavik is... goes for a takedown here. Oh. Oh. Sanjeet is trying to defend. Atabek gets the takedown. But Sanjeet is right back up on his feet. Now Atabek is trying to go for the back. He's controlling Sanjeet from his back. Sanjeet needs to be careful here. This can get dangerous. He better be careful grabbing onto the fence as well. And Daniel will take a point away. Atabek well, looking to put his hooks in. He's got oh, he's one got, hook in. He's got one hook in. Oh, this is dangerous, guys. This is right into the body lock, guys. He's We're in a body lock. In. Suddenly, Sanjeet is in a bad situation now. Very bad situation. Now, just like you said in a, in a former fight, both of these guys are extremely sweaty. So it's going to be very difficult to secure. Well, it looks Sanjeet's bleeding from his right eye. Probably this... because of one of those punches that connected. At the moment, Atabek trying to control <laughs> Sanjeet with the body lock. This is kind of what happened with uh, Angad and Mohammed Gamal. Gamal was dominating and striking and then Angad just got the back and that was it. Fight was over. Atabek has got the seat belt on. 
soon he'll try to go no for the neck. Notice here, Sanjit is doing a good job of controlling his wrist and keeping him from climbing up to his neck. Yeah, that is really key here. If he gets one hand on the neck, that's when he can finish the choke. Oops. Ooh. Oh, and he got it as got I it. said it. Well, 50 seconds still on the clock. Sanjit needs to be very, very careful here. He needs to stay in there calm. Sanjit needs to stay calm, exactly, Raul. And control his wrist. Wrist control is paramount right now, guys. He also needs to be trying to turn into Atabek. Well, it's just approximately 30 more seconds into this round. What a fight we have. Clear domination by Atabek here. Both fighters seeming pretty fatigued at this point right now in the third round. Less than 15 more seconds. Sanjeet has done a good job of defending himself here. Yes, I agree wholeheartedly. What a fight. Guys, we move into the championship rounds for the first time in the history of MFN. Look at these combinations by Sanjeet. He's mixing it up. Nice head movement. He slips, he throws those hooks, those kicks. He was looking very, very good in the beginning till this happened. And then the game changed. Then Atabek got Sanjeet's back. And all Sanjeet could do was defend himself from that rare naked choke. Well, he defended himself well. Otherwise, you know, it would have been game over for Sanjeev. Oh that yeah, he did a good job of saving himself from that choke. Guys, every time Sanjeev moves his head, he finds success. He moves his head, he found success with a check left hook or a nice right hand. If I'm Sanjeev's corner right now, I'm going to say, keep your head moving. Utilize that jab. Let's continue to kick the cap. If I'm out of back, I'm going to be saying, let's keep Jabbing. Jab, 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 takedown. Jab, 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 takedown. Let's see how these championship rounds play out. Round number four is going to start here. और दोनों फाइटर्स अब एक दूसरे की रिस्पेक्ट करते हैं दोनों फाइटर्स को अब पता चल चुका है कि दूसरे में कितनी शक्ति है जॉन बोथ दीज फाइटर्स नाउ रिस्पेक्ट ईच अदर वट यू थिंक या वीर सीन अलिट बिट मोर रिस्पेक्ट एंड देर टायर्ड यू नो वर इन द फोर्थ राउंड लेट सी हु वॉन्ट इट मोर एट दिस पॉइंट well, Sanjeet looks a bit tired for sure. Atabek had a bit of success in the previous round with that back take and, a, and an attempt to take the rear naked. Nice leg kicks by Sanjeet, very fast. Yeah, two in a row. Every time he swaps to that or, uh, southpaw stance, he finds success with that kick. Yeah, he's using his body movements really well in this fight. Switching Ooh. stances, attacking head the liver. Love it. Lots of body shots he has thrown in this fight. Sanjit is all in. He's throwing in the right kick and then charging in with a big left hand. Mm. Atabek is doing a good job of keeping that right hand up, otherwise, Sanjit's left hook would be devastating. He's yes. keeping Sanjit at bay at the moment with that. Left hand. Yes, that is his range finder. He's using it wonderfully, spectacularly as a range finder right now. Keeping Sanjeet at bay. Both guys are very respectful of each other's power. Well, Sanjeet slipped a little bit because of sweat on the floor. Oh, he throws in a hard, big body shot. Hard shots from Sanjeet. Two body shots. Well, I think Atabek knows the power that Sanjeet packs in his punches, and that's the reason, you know, he's not, he's not letting him close the range. Yes, I agree. Let's see if Atabek tries to take him down again. 
Yes, I think Atabek should because last time he did that, it worked for him. Yes, hit him with a couple jabs, level change. There we go. Oh, Atabek goes in for the takedown. But he can't do it like that. He's got to set it up. No, he certainly needs to set it up. Hide it behind a few punches, some combinations. What he needs to do is get Sanjeet moving backwards, utilizing his combinations, have a level change and take him down. Whoa, Ooh, nice, nice jabs followed by a right hand. Charges in, throws that a big back. Again though, he's not finding much success landing because Adebek is able to see all of his punches coming from his waist. You really want him to put his hands up, I you, do, John? man, and it is driving me crazy. <laughs> well, if it goes to the next round, which is round number five, it's going to be crazy because we know that Sanjeet definitely has the, the gas tank, but let's see how Atavik responds to it. Oh, ah, oh, Atavik is bleeding. He's bleeding from his nose. Looks like he has a smaller cut on his lip as well. Nice combos from Atavik. Nice head movement by Sanjeet to get to the inside. But again, Atabek doing a great job. Oh, Ooh, Sanjeet nice. lands a right big hand right. over Atabek's jab. Beautiful. Apne desi share hai Sanjeet Budwar. Bahut sare fans hain inke India mein. Bahut sare log hain jo abhi live dekh rahe honge. Oh, nice, nice left hand by Sanjeet there. Well, here in Atabek looks a little bit tired with his movement. What do you have to say about that, John? He does. He's he's starting to tire right now. Let's see if Sanjeet can get to the inside. Maybe get a clinch. Maybe hit a nice left hand or a right hand. Sanjeet needs to continue moving his head, trying to get in. He needs to be on the inside if he's going to connect with these punches. Looks like this fight is going to go all five rounds. Nice and jabs by Adebek here. <laughs> well, this is crazy and exciting at the same time. Nice left hook. Very Ten good seconds left to hook. go. Sanjeet unleashing the beast in him. <laughs> well, this fight goes wow. to the fifth good round. Fight, man. MFN 10 again making history in the Indian MMA. This featherweight title fight is a firecracker, man. Just look at this. It is. Then Sanjeet doing a good job of slipping that jab, working his body, and then coming back up to the top, stuffing that takedown. Sanjeet is a, is a wild man. Again, though, Adebek has done a good job of keeping Sanjeet at bay, utilizing that pawing jab. He uses his range finder, Sanjeet gets close, bam, uses that jab. Let's get started with round number five. Referee Daniel Isaac ne kya explosive shuruvat kari hai is akhri round ki. Both these guys look a little bit tired. Adebek's stance is a little bit wider. Sanjeet needs to go back to kicking his lead leg. Oh, Adebek tries to nice. go for the takedown without a setup. Bahut badiya defend kiya Sanjeet ne. Well, you can't be doing that with the silent killer, man. And it's Great also team. very difficult to grapple in this round because they're both so sweaty. It's very easy to just slip out. It is. And as you see, Sanjeet didn't have to move. He was pushed back because of the sweat. Well, John, you know, besides boxing, Sanjeet has also trained in, in Desi Indian wrestling. 
and therefore his sprawl is very good. Yes, it is. He has great takedown defense. We saw that in the keys to victory. He's got to defend the takedowns. Even though we did not see a lot of takedown attempts from Atabek, which is kind of surprising. I would have liked to see Atabek attempt more takedowns in the earlier oh, rounds. Oh, Atabek swinging in. Sanjeev with the great head movement there, guys. Able to slip right out. Sanjeet utilizing head movement to put pressure on Atabek now. Let's see if he can hunt him down, put his back against the cage, and land some of those shots. Nice right hand by Sanjeet there. Fantastic movement by Sanjeet. He's like a sniper honing in on his target. Sanjeet definitely putting on the pressure this round. Atabek seems to be pretty tired. Nice catch. Wow. Catches the kick and fires back. John, do you see a knockout coming in in you the know, last three minutes? It's I can't call that, but right Ooh. now, I would say probably not. I think this fight's going to go the distance. Well, it's come a long way. This is the round number five. It what depends. a fabulous performance by both these guys. Fabulous. Agreed. Who? Sanjeet. Sanjeet doing a really good job right now with his head movement, putting pressure on Atabek. Well, Sanjeet's got a lot of fire in him still, and we can see Atabek is, is playing defensive. He is playing very defensive. He's defending defensive. more than charging. He is agreed. Nice left hand right there by Sanjeet. Well, Sanjeet is the kind of a guy who can still create, can still produce a knockout. Definitely, Sanjeet seems to be dominating here towards the end of this fight. Back to the leg kick. That's what I'm talking about. You know, what I really like about Sanjeet is he's got both. He's got wild draw power as well as a system and a strategy. Man, you can't be doing that with Sanjeet, you know. You can't be taking him down without a setup. No, I agree. He's no easy prey for those takedowns. He's no easy prey. And just... Like a professional, sprawled back, stuffed his head, and stood right back up. I'm yeah. surprised he didn't throw a knee right after. Plus, those takedowns seem to be coming from desperation because nothing else is working. Well, yes, Atabek's corner is also looking a little bit desperate here. Both these guys sweating profusely, as my <laughs> friend John says. Less than 90 seconds to this fight. Whoa! These guys are swinging for it now. I think Sanjeet wants a knockout. Sanjeet wants war. But he's an intelligent fighter. He's not going to make any mistakes. If he gets a knockout, he might take it. But he's not going to make any mistakes what or take fight. any unnecessary risks at this moment. Less than 60 seconds, ladies and gentlemen. Championship rounds for the men's featherweight title, which is up for grabs. Both little, these guys swinging heavy. Little bit of uptick here. I don't know if you guys are seeing it as well. Nice with the leg kick. Well, Atabek looks a little bit charged up as we have less than 35 seconds to this round. What a fight, guys. What a fight. The what? main event couldn't have been better than this. No. It's been an excellent night of fights. We've got less than 10 seconds. Wow. Before. Whoa. Sanjeet's head movement, guys. He is moving that head. He's a hard to hit. Yeah, yeah. He's avoiding all, right. all those Great punches. Fight. And guys, this fight goes all five rounds. Isn't Man. that amazing? John Manon, what an exciting fight night it has been. You know, we've seen some spectacular knockouts. Let's and look at the recap of the last round. The cage was obviously very slippery because of the sweat. Atabek started throwing these straight kicks somehow in this last round. Sandeep, uh, Sanjeet caught a few of those kicks. Of course, continued with his boxing. And John, like you said, great head movement throughout the round. Well, the decision now is up to the judges. Let's see who becomes the featherweight champion of Matrix Fight Night. Let's see. Let's see who becomes the first 
featherweight champion at <laughs> MFN 10. That's correct, Rahul. The first time ever we have title fights in MFN and not just one. We had four title fights today. What, what an, an incredible amazing night. night. I don't think it could be any better. Incredible. Well, couldn't be, couldn't be. How could it be? One more title fight, five title fights. Well, John, I think this has been the biggest fight festival for all the Indian MMA fans. Yeah. People have been watching us live on Hotstar throughout the country. Uh, this is really a historic moment in Indian MMA, you know. I can't wait for MFN 11 and I can't wait for these title defenses, John. I can't wait either. I'm really looking forward to seeing Priya. Priya get a chance All at right, guys, title. now it is time for the official decision. We go over to Jared in the cage. Gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecards. After five rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecards. <laughs> Judge Vishray scored about 46 49. Judge Manas scored about 47 48. And Judge Mohit scored about 46 49. For your winner, by unanimous, and now. The new MFN featherweight champion of the world, Sanjit Bodwar! All right, ladies and gentlemen. We've got everyone inside with us. Tiger giving the belt. Tanvi, we've got all our special guests in. We've got Aisha ma'am, we've got Krishna. Would you like you to join us in the middle as well? For this very historic equation, ma'am, on that side. Sanjeet Baji. Chalo. Aapke jane se pehle, Sanjeet Baji, kuch baat te ho jayen. Aapne jo kar diya tha, aapne kar diya. Udhar, yes. Aur jo socha tha, jo bola tha, बहुत वाइटिंग भी बीच में चली थी बस कर दिया आपने बाजी आपने हम सबको खुश कर दिया तालियां हो जाए इसके लिए दिस इज व्हाट इट वाज ऑल अबाउट बाजी कुछ अब जय बाबा की भाई सारे भैया ने धन्यवाद भाई सारे भैया का फाइट देखने खातिर वो था भाई पुरानी बात थी मजाक कॉमेडी थी वो था भाई गिल कोई ना हो था चल गई भाई बिल्कुल बोल रहे थे कि एक्चुअली दिस इज गोइंग बैक टू द प्रेस कॉन्फ्रेंस जहां बोल रहे थे ये क्या कॉमेडी करता है क्या तो सुजीत पाजी ने अपनी कॉमेडी दिखा दी एंड आई थिंक दैट इज व्हाट इट वाज ऑल अबाउट पाजी लेकिन बेल्ट जो आपको मिल चुकी है अब क्या बोलना चाहेंगे पूरी फैमिली साथ में है इन्होंने आपको बहुत सपोर्ट किया है ये ये कुछ ये कुछ सब की बेल्ट है भाई ये दोनों साथ में मिल गए अब एक नया हथियार और साथ में आया है भाई अश्विन सर आए हैं साथ में जी और काफी कॉन्फिडेंस मिल रहा है फाइट के लिए जी धन्यवाद कुछ सब का बाकी मेरी टीम का भी जो साथ में मिल गए एक दो और नए नए लड़के हैं उनको अभी जल्दी ले के आएंगे भाई जी एमएफएन में एमएफएन में नए चीजें तैयार हो रही हैं दो तीन बढ़िया अच्छा मैम ये नए लड़के तैयार हो रहे हैं आपके लिए <laughs> इनको जरा बता मैम और सर को और बढ़िया देंगे भाई एक दो लड़के रेडी है तैयार है आपका अस्तबल रेडी है जहां पे लड़के एकदम बाहर निकल जाएंगे और रेडी है बस एकदम तैयार करके भेजे हैं भाई चलो बढ़िया बाजी थैंक यू सो मच सारे भैया का बहुत-बहुत कांग्रेचुलेशंस थैंक यू वेरी मच